one was done in 1932 and then again in 1948. The, the 1948 was in color. Uh, Pico sent their cameraman with a 16 millimeter camera. And here's some boys playing soccer down on the athletic field. One of the things we installed uh, on the athletic field was a backstop for a baseball uh, game if somebody wanted to play baseball down there. Also, we, uh, we did a, a uh, sign that is, uh, has all the history of camp wear uh, over at Camp Wear, and also the history of uh, all around this camp. We've got three signs, one at Buzzards Rock, one down by the, uh, it sort of tells the history of that, which goes back, people don't realize this, 10,000 years with the Indians there. We, had, we did a, a, a dig there some years back, and that's what the archaeologists found. Apparently that deep is 10,000 years. So he said they said 10,000 years for the uh, for the Indians and then 80 years for the Boy Scouts. <laughs> so anyway. we got a ways to catch up, don't we? And we went, the Boy Scouts apparently made a mess of the uh, place. And then they found some arrowheads which weren't very authentic, and they were called Hegar um, Hegar uh, artifacts. And uh, Ernie, no, no, you may you may or may not know something about that, but they were made they were arrowheads made of, uh, of, of some material that was foreign to them, and foreign to the Indians, anyway. So, um, that's basically uh, kind of what we do, and we're, we did the, he didn't mention uh, that we redid the picnic grove a few years ago and brought in, I don't know how many dick, you know how many truckloads of dirt to fill in that and make it wonderful to improve the, the center of the camp. So we're really pleased to be able to do that, and we have a great uh, executive committee, and, uh, and we do a good job.